and welcome back to Torch TV. Have you ever noticed that stairs are kind of sketchy? What do you mean? I don't know, they just always seem to be up to something. Patience. It's hard to wait for something you know might not happen. But it's even harder to give it up when you know it's something you really want. Happy birthday to Cameron Duncan. This week we will be naming our elves on the shelf. You can make your vote for a name in the office. We have one boy elf and one girl elf to name. And now let's welcome Rajveer with Career Q&A. Hi there, today on Career Q&A, we're going to explore the career of teaching. As many of you likely know, we have a larger array of class choices compared to last year, which means more work for teachers and for us. This includes basic subjects like history and science and many electives. We've interviewed three teachers to see how important teaching is to them. We asked Mrs. Wheelis, who has been teaching for nine years and who is a seventh grade history teacher, what is tough about being a teacher? She replied saying that she enjoys teaching very much and that even though it can be tough to grade homework, she cares for all of the students. We care for you too, Mrs. Wheelis. The art and home economics teacher, Mrs. Wilson, told us that she likes to see students grow and succeed. Mrs. Wilson has been teaching for a whopping 34 years. Now that's what I call experience. We also spoke to Mrs. Moon. We asked what are the pros and cons of teaching for you? She's a seventh grade math and avid teacher who has been teaching for about nine years. She says she likes it when a student understands something that they didn't know before. Mrs. Moon says she gets worried when a student decides not to focus or offer their full potential. These three teachers, along with our other inspiring teachers and staff members, have shown a great deal of pride in our campus and in us. Make sure to show your appreciation for our teachers too. Thanks, Rashmir. Continue to sell candy bars. If you need another box, please see Mrs. North. You will need to turn in the money for the box you sold before receiving the new box. If you have decided to now sell candy, you may pick up a permission slip in the office and return it to Mrs. Christman. Make sure to have your baby pictures turned in to Mr. Smothers by Friday. Have a great National Blue Jeans Day. And stand to be respectful as your teacher leads your class in the flag salute. I'm Zach. And I'm Lenny. And, and you've, you've been, been torched. torched.